I remember I went by this hotel a couple of years ago. I would go by every now and then. It's one of those paid by the week hotels where, you know, drug addicts and everybody who's down on their luck end up staying. I was in one of those places and I remember uh, wanting to die. Just I didn't want to get out of bed anymore. It was freezing cold. And every time, every morning, everybody would come out and start their old cars. And, and there was a crack under the door about this wide. And I just prayed that the fumes would just fill the car, fill the room and I would just die. The pain was too much. What I'd been through was too much. Um, I'm homeless, I don't have food to eat, I'm done. And in that moment, as I'm sitting there praying in tears, all the cars drive away almost simultaneously. They're like, okay, I guess I have to get up and go to work today. Those moments gave me like, you're gonna be okay. So I would say to anybody, just look for the little things that encourage you, even if you don't see anything, the little small things that keep you going. So for every little thing that somebody did, I was able to make a little step and each step was forward. And to be here on this side, what I say to anybody, had I stopped then, had I died then, had I given up, I would have missed the best part of my life. I would have missed being able to help thousands of people see their dreams come true. So my hope for anyone who knows, like you know it in your soul, there's something, no path, nothing makes sense. You don't know how to get there, but you know for sure something's out there one little step at a time. Keep going.